All right, guys. Well, today is the day. We're starting a new build log series. And uh, if you guys have been following along, we just redid my car, the 2018 Mitsubishi Mirage, uh, coined the go-kart. That's what I like to call it. That's, my, that's what my wife called it. So now that's what we call it. It's got those uh, two Savard 12s on 6K. Well, I've got another vehicle too. It's a 2010 Toyota Tundra. Uh, I've had a system in this truck for a really long time. Um, but it's time to change things up. What was in here before, it was a blow through. Uh, it had two Sundown XV218s in a fourth order blow through. And they were on those uh, Wolfram C2400s, two of them. So I had them strapped. And those things like were the budget amp to get for like a year. I mean, all the all the um, channels that do the amp dynos had these things on them. Anyway, they were great amps. Um, but it's time to upgrade. So what we're going to be doing now is going from a fourth order to a sixth order. And instead of two 18s, we're going to be running three 18s. And uh, those XV2s are discontinued now. Uh, but you can still find some suppliers that sell them. So since I already had two of them, I hopped on down for sound and saw that they still had some in stock. So I got another one. Instead of having to buy three brand new subs, I'm using the two that I got and then a brand new one from down for sound. Um, <coughs> we're going to be upgrading the amp too. I'm going to be using one of those uh, Team Pi amps, the TP7500. And a friend of mine locally here uh, had one and was letting it go for a really good deal. So I snatched it up and that's what we're going to be using for the bass. Also, I uh, <clears throat> my first trial of door pods was in this truck. Um, it got the job done, but they didn't look that great. And I think there's some room for improvement. So we're going to be doing that too. We're going to be building some new uh, door pods, running new mids and highs amps, running new mids and highs speakers. I mean, the whole thing. We're going to be doing start to finish a complete rebuild on this truck we're going to be doing a lithium battery we're going to be doing excuse me rewiring the whole truck new mids and highs in the doors new door pods new amp rack under the seat sixth order blow through i mean this is going to be a process so i'm just going to take you guys from start to finish the whole thing and then when we're done it'll be a great day right um so I did end up getting rid of that fourth order box. Luckily, somebody out in Phoenix wanted it and I was able to sell it to them. Um, and so that took care of that. Um, but now we don't have any base in this truck. So we got to get something back in here in a hurry, right? Um, one other thing, I kept talking to my wife like, man, my other car's got a name called the go-kart this truck needs a name man i've had this truck since 2015 and this is like my baby man and it had a base it had base in it already didn't have a name we got to name this thing so i thought well this was the truck that i used to drive to alaska when i moved there and when i moved back it also got me through Canada. I drove it back, right? This thing has taken me everywhere. Um, my nickname is Husky. A lot of people think that that's Husky the dog from like, you know, the mushing dogs. It's not. Um, but this truck is also white. So I thought, you know, a Toyota Tundra that's white that took me to Alaska. My name's Husky, right? What better name than the Yeti? This is the Yeti. So now we're going to be calling this the Yeti build. 
This is going to be three Sundown X18s on 7,500 watts in a sixth order blow through. I hope you guys enjoyed the video log. Cause I just wanna hear it out your mouth, yeah Give me fuel, it's a tool that I use To go ahead and run my f out, yeah I take shots, I take loss, I make shots, I miss lots I tell you get big box, you get yachts You swing lots and pop off a big shot I ain't done chasing Got big dreams, bigger things, impatient Who's at the top?